Um, it's great to be at Jitex right now. Um, we at Lenovo have found that the digital adoption across, whether it is from a consumption point of view of customers or from the industry, which is trying to approach their customers, has changed dramatically in the last couple of years. What Lenovo is trying to do is to make sure that we take every business as digital and every product as a service, okay? That's how Lenovo has tried to evolve. So what does that mean? That we are talking about the access devices, the IoT, then we are talking about the infrastructure, and then we are talking about the vertical solutions. Vertical solutions means every industry, manufacturing, retail, every industry we are trying to give a solution. And if you look at all these three areas, this is what we are trying to display at Jidex today. We are talking about hybrid workspaces through our workstations. So we are saying you can work from anywhere. You can collaborate. We have collaboration technology and solutions, which we are displaying at Jidex. So that's one part of our display at Jidex. This we are very excited about. We are also excited about the infrastructure solutions which we have, our servers, our storage, our solutions, which are allowing people to store data. And the most exciting part, which I believe is going to really take over, is the vertical solutions. Industries are falling behind sometimes in adopting new technologies like AI, like uh, virtual solutions using AR, VR. We are displaying that how industries can use these technologies in manufacturing, in construction, in medical, to make sure that they can produce products or deliver service at a much more efficient and innovative way. And that's what we're displaying at Jidex. So, thank you. Uh, so, not only last year, last few years, Lenovo has been rewarded for its customer centricity by achieving great results. At a worldwide level, our, our quarter one, which is calendar quarter, quarter two, we achieved $17 billion worth of revenue in a quarter. It's amazing performance. Lenovo is the number one PC company. It's growing fast in, in infrastructure solutions. It's growing fast in the mobile space. In the region, Middle East, Turkey and Africa, which I uh, take care of, we are now the number one PC brand with 28.5% share. That's tremendous for a brand which was nowhere in the last, you know, for six or seven years back. Our ISG business has grown 58.9% year on year. Our phone business has grown 13% year on year. Our services business has grown 60, more than 60% year on year. It's a fantastic space to be in. And I think the customers have rewarded Lenovo because of the way we have treated our customers and partners with respect, but also giving them acceleration in their digital journey. You know, a, a very challenging question because there is so much stuff happening on the technology side, both on across, uh, on, the, on the user uh, content access, which is the IoT devices, where we are launching products like X1 Fold, uh, revising our X1s and Legion. There's a lot of stuff happening on the content uh, access devices. There's a lot of stuff happening on infrastructure side with edge technology. And there's a lot of stuff happening on the vertical solution side. So, but one thing which, if I were to pick one thing, which is my personal favorite is uh, the AR and VR space. I think the augmented reality and the virtual reality spaces, those are, their potential is yet to be utilized by a lot of industries and a lot of companies. To be able to virtualize things, to be able to do things which are not in reality, but in a digitized safe space, you can monitor, you can maintain, you can innovate, you can do research. I think the potential of that space is just getting open. So uh, if you were to ask me, I think AR and VR space where Lenovo is very active and we are, we are enabling customers at various lands, that's the space where I think uh, there'll be a lot of uh, exciting developments in the next couple of years. Oh, yes. So, um, Lenovo is having its own Think Reality A A3 uh, headset. Plus, we have engaged with a lot of partners. One of the partners we have engaged with is Vario. It's on display on our Jitex stand as well, where um, uh, we are the customer is able to really immerse into a situation. So, the people like astronauts, pilots, even nuclear reactor uh, operators, they can be trained in those scenarios. So they, they can be put virtually in those scenarios. You can even design cars, uh, you know, in those scenarios. So Lenovo is partnering with people who have the technology, who are using our platform and our solutions to show, to, to deliver those solutions to the customers. Um, Lenovo is a channel-centric company. 
all the solutions in Middle East, Turkey and Africa, we are delivering to our customers through our channel partners. We have tried to be and are a very easy company to deal with and we are improving for our channels all the time. About the kind of solutions we want to partner our uh, channel partners with, there's a range. We are very active in the PC devices, which we now are, as we said, number one through our partners in the region. We are also trying to partner in terms of services. Um, our, all our services are delivered through our partners as well. Those are the places where we think we are, our engagement level with our partners has gone up. If I, if I were to say two things, we are an easy company to deal with, we are channel focused, and we want to make sure that the success of the channel is our success. That's how we have designed this space. Uh, Lenovo has looked at, in the last three years, the digital adoption in various spaces of consumers and industry. And we have tried to adopt and even accelerate our transformation because of what we see is useful for the customers. Our motto of smarter technology for all is based on providing the latest solutions to the customers, the technologically, uh, technologically on the edge solutions, but also we say in ISG, uh, solving humanity's greatest problems. That's quite a lofty goal. So you need to be very focused and being, and really have to invest in R&D to be able to achieve those goals. So I'm proud to say Lenovo investment in R&D has really, the commitment is quite high. Uh, we are, um, we have already said last year, our chairman said that we will double our investments in R&D in three years. We are hiring 12,000 people in R&D. Now, where are we hiring these people? These people in R&D is supposed to make things easier for our customers. Whether it's making it easier through our artificial intelligence, whether it's making it easier through our AR, VR solutions, whether it's making it it's, uh, uh, easier through OEM solutions in manufacturing, in warehousing, in storage, in all these places. Lenovo is investing in all these areas to make sure that we are solving the problems customer is facing on the field. But all these solutions we want to deliver to our customers through our channel partners. Uh, so, I personally, I am quite excited to be at Jitex. Um, um, in the over the last three years, we have understood as as humankind that uh, events like these cannot be taken for granted anymore. Um, and it's a pleasure to be able to meet people face to face. The region of Middle East, Turkey, and Africa is growing very fast in digital adoption. People here, the companies here are very innovative and their hunger for technologies is quite high. To be able to deliver on those expectations, you need platforms like Jitex, where you are able to, first of all, showcase the, the breadth and the, you know, the total diversity of your portfolio. That is one. You are not able to do that in a day-to-day, -day, everyday meetings. You are able to meet people face-to-face -face and deliver to them the whole portfolio expectations and a platform like Jitex. To be able to meet people, uh, customers, partners, uh, either they are our partners today or they will be our partners tomorrow. To be able to meet all those people in a, under a single uh, uh, umbrella is a fantastic thing for a company like Lenovo. So we are happy to be at Jitex and we would you know, like to use the platform on Jitex more and more and we would like others to use it more and more.